Okay. Well, that was a horrible clap. So from a young age, I grew up hearing about my grandparents' stories in the mission field. Um, they spent most of their lives in Africa and um, witnessing to people there and traveling all over the world. They had this really big map in um, their office where I would stay the night and they had pins everywhere all over the world. And so that really interested me as a kid. Um, so I'd ask them about it. In the back of my mind, like as a child, I always like wondered like, what drove them to like go and live in the middle of nowhere. Church of the Mill actually had a trip to Nicaragua coming up my ninth grade year. And I had asked my parents if I could go and they said yes. And I hadn't been exposed that much to like different people groups and people who hadn't ever heard about the Lord because I had grown up um, in Christian circles and in public school most people had still heard about Jesus but I was exposed to people who had never heard of Jesus before. That really really tugged at my heart and I just like started thinking about like why wouldn't I share the gospel with people. I spent three months in Uganda working for Benjamin House Ministries taking photos and I would go around the slums and we would go around villages and I'd ask, hey, can I take a photo of you? And um, we'd take the photo and that would open up a gateway to have a conversation and to tell their story and that each person has a story. And it was just a gateway into that and a really, really unique way of expressing like the image of God through humanity. I feel like being behind the camera has um, shaped my view of missions, seeing that every human is made in the image of God, um, seeing his character through each person, no matter who they are, because I feel like photography is a very like intimate art form because you're trying to capture who a person is, and God is evident in each person and his characteristics. Anyone can do missions, and we're all called to do missions. Um, it's not just an option. You don't have to hop on a plane. You don't have to be labeled a missionary. You don't have to be necessarily labeled as a ministry. Introversion, extroversion, outgoing, shy. Um, no matter what your gift is, no matter your personality, it can be used for God's glory. God has a plan. He, he made you the way you are, and he gave you the gifts for a reason.